Hey everyone, it's Amy, and I am here to share with you the next oil in our hashtag dream kit education series, and it's pink pepper. Who is ready to learn about like the superhero of the new oils? This little guy, girl, I like to call her the girl, I think she's a superhero. Pink pepper, comes in a 5 ml bottle, it smells amazing, but you're not gonna use it for that. You're gonna use it for so many things, but this is, um, this is a different kind of oil. And um, so let's go through like the overview, okay, at first. So it supports healthy immune system, digestive system, respiratory system, can be soothing to the nervous system, and it promotes a healthy cellular and immune function response. So um, what does all that mean, right? <laughs> like that's a lot of words, Amy. <laughs> Tell us what it means. Um, I will. Um, it basically means it's good for every inch of your body. And we're gonna tell you exactly how to do that at the end, okay? It's super simple. Um, but why is it so powerful to, you, to us? And why do we want this in our everyday routine? Um, because it includes two main chemical components that are so powerful to our health and everyday wellness. And that's limonene and alpha phalandrine. okay? So I invite you to go to PubMed, as I have in these other um, oil education series this week, because there are so much research and scientific studies on these, um, on these oils. And so you can look up the actual chemical components and find out exactly what those do. So again, limonene, you can look that up, but even more powerful, look up alpha, alpha phalandrine, and it has 15 to 30% of that chemical component. So this is a really, really rich oil. It's, it's pretty amazing. So alpha phalandrine, I'll give you a highlight, is been scientifically proven. Again, you can check it out on PubMed to protect and nurture cells. That's huge, guys. That's really huge. This is a cell guardian in every way. But what does that mean to us, right? So when cells are going through mitosis and they're dividing, what do we want to happen? We want healthy cells to divide and continue on, right? We want them to be nurtured and protected. That's where pink pepper comes in and does that. What do we want to happen to the bad cells, the not so healthy ones? Goodbye, die, be done. We don't want them to continue to multiply, right? And so that's where pink pepper steps in. You reading between the lines what pink pepper could do for you? It's pretty amazing, right? So it's similar benefits. So you got pink pepper, okay? And then you have DDR Prime. If you don't know about DDR Prime, it comes in both a soft gel and an oil. This is not a new product, but they are recommending these two are powerhouse together. So if you don't have DDR Prime yet and you have pink pepper, start off with start with pink pepper right away, okay? And same with if you have DDR Prime, continue taking that. Make sure you take that every day. So DDR Prime is damaged DNA repair. It's a blend of really great oils that protect and nurture, nurture your cells, similar to what pink pepper will do. <laughs> Say that 10 times. So I recommend taking these every day together, okay? If it gives you an idea, at convention, there was a slide shown by Emily Wright. Okay, and none of us noticed, we all saw it, but didn't catch on to it, okay? Um, it, it was a big white screen, right? And then it had these two on the side with a little bit of writing and talked about them being powerhouse oils, right? And then when I get back from convention, I'm, I'm in a leadership group and I was looking at a slide and someone said, did anyone notice what was on that slide? So you had these two, right, on one side and then on the background, you had this big pink, very pale ribbon in the back. Pink ribbon. Okay, so doTERRA is really good at giving us clues without being non-compliant. So what is compliance on a side note, right? So if you're fairly new to oils or specifically to doTERRA, they are very good at following the rules and working with the FDA. And we are not a pharmaceutical company, nor do we wanna be. Um, and so we don't want to make claims with diseases. So we have to be really careful about what we say, okay? So that's why we don't usually use disease names, but instead we talk about inflammation and cellular health. It's not that we're trying to be silly, it's that we're trying to be compliant. And so when I advocate to you all, and I challenge you to go to PubMed and check out a certain chemical component, it's basically my way of saying, there's something big here and I want you to know about it. Hint, hint, <laughs> right? So you can either read between the lines or go do your research, okay? So again, powerful cellular support. So another amazing benefit of alpha phalandrine, the chemical component in pink pepper, 
is that it activates natural killer cells um, to boost your immune system. So the next time you're feeling under the weather, I would up your dosage of pink pepper and that's gonna help boost your immune system, okay? And it also is great for alleviating neuropathic discomfort, okay? Um, oh, Julie, your voice has gone on my end. Uh, I hope it's still okay. I'll keep going and hopefully it works. Um, so it alleviates neuropathic discomfort. And so um, it's not just uh, you know pain that you have at that moment. When you're talking neuropathic, it's, it's long, long lasting chronic pain. And so these Aroma Touch, so you can combine pink pepper and Aroma Touch together. And these are gonna work beautifully together to give you a lot of relief from that pain. And I know a lot of you are dealing with some of that chronic pain and that's why you're using essential oil. So I think you're gonna love that duo together. Um, so you'd wanna put those kind of equal parts with some fractionated coconut oil and rub it on that part of your body feeling the pain and then perhaps add some heat too and that's gonna add even um, more relief for you, okay? And the most important way to use this oil, as I said in the beginning, it's gonna be the simplest way to use it, okay? And this is everyday usage. This is what doTERRA is recommending. One drop a day internally. So you can put it in your water, you can put it under your tongue. I've been putting it in my water, one drop of pink pepper, one drop of green mandarin, and it tastes so good. So I think you're gonna really enjoy that, okay? So one drop of pink pepper a day, and it's gonna help every inch of your body um, in providing some of this support, okay? So hopefully this has helped you a little bit understand about pink pepper, and um, if you do go to PubMed, let me know what you learned, because I've been astounded by what um, some of the studies I've learned from. And have a great day, and tune in tomorrow for our next hashtag Dream Education Series. Have a great night. Bye.